Stephen Hook has been homeless for about two years, spending a lot of his time at the emergency shelter of northern Kentucky. But soon he'll run out of the number of nights he can stay there, meaning he may be back out on the street. And starting in July, that would become illegal under a new Kentucky law. Going in reverse. You know, it's going to set everyone back months. You know, you, you going to court, clogging courts up, a, you know, they deal with serious crime, you know. But, you know, if you pass out a bus stop, you don't need a ticket or something like that. The U.S. Supreme Court Monday heard arguments on an ordinance in Grants Pass, Oregon, barring public camping or sleeping outside, which many say criminalized homelessness. The ordinance is very similar to a section in the new Safer Kentucky Act, a sweeping crime bill passed by Republican lawmakers who also overrode Governor Andy Beshear's veto. NKU law professor Michael Mannheimer expects the Supreme Court to uphold the Oregon ordinance given its current makeup. That would essentially keep the Kentucky law in place. But if not? If the Supreme Court overturns the Grants Pass ordinance, um, yeah, I think the Kentucky law would be in trouble, I think it would be constitutionally suspect. Jason McKinley is on staff at the Covington shelter, but was homeless off and on for several years before becoming sober in 2020. He says the new law is a bad idea because it would make it harder for people to get jobs or get out of debt. And how can someone that is going through homelessness be expected to pay a fine? You know, that's just that's a trap in the system. In Covington, James Pilcher, Local 12 News. Thanks for checking out the Local 12 YouTube channel. Click the links and tap subscribe to get notified anytime we post.